Pretty fancy place they got here. Dang, that's a lot of guards. There's no way this isn't a trap. That's a lot of guards. What? Where there's no way we're getting out. Oh wait, this is one of the this is one of the guys who was in the um opening cinematic too. Howdy everyone, my name is Taren. Welcome to part 9 of my first playthrough in Tales of Arise. In this part, we meet up with the Earth Lord Dolim, and I have to say, he's not anything like what I was expecting. I was just so enthused throughout this section of the game, wondering what secrets laid behind the flashy exterior of LD Manencia. Anyways, before we get on to unraveling the secrets of the Earth Realm, please consider subscribing, leaving a like, checking out all my links found in the description because it really does help me out and now let's get on to more tales of arise you're the wielder of the blazing sword the liberator of Kalak. Huh. you do dress humbly for someone of such grandeur but where are my manners i am the ruler of elder this, this music is uh menacing if you know who we are then you know how strange it is to invite us into your palace I thought I'd clear up your misconceptions before things could escalate. What do you say? <sighs> you did come here to defeat me, did you not? Perhaps, and what if we did? Are you planning to fight us here? I don't think that will be necessary. After all, I imagine you've taken in a fair amount of his scent by this point. Have you come across even one slave being abused? Soldiers killing for sport? Suffering of any form? I would hazard that you have not. For I have liberated Menencia from its suffering and brought joy to its people. Mm. But if these results are not enough to stay your sword. Oh, shiz. Oh, Shion. Oh, snap. Oh, Shion just got knocked out. Nope. Shion. I commend you for your boldness. But it won't work on me. Wow. Still, your would be Fluid assassination of go motion. Unpunished. Elfin. Fair enough. Allow me to host you for dinner. We shall continue our talk then. Kelzalik? I don't know. I, I kind of like this guy. Please escort our guests, if you would be so kind. As you wish, sire. I kind of like this guy. I want I want to know more about him, of course, but I kind of like him. What I get? What were you thinking, attacking him on your own? What are you upset about? Our whole goal is supposed to be overthrowing the lords. Remember? He could have been hurt. And it wouldn't have been the first time either. What's gotten into you? Hey, you do know that Alfin is really just worried about you, right? He's worried? I mean, that's what it looked like to me. Uh, but, um, maybe not. I think he is just worried. Uh, loose cannon. Oh, she gained another AG, cool. Uh, what were we trying to get up on her? Uh, we got Healing Circle, we got Overlimit Extension, Lunar Corruption, Easy Overlimit makes it easier for you to trigger Overlimit. Ooh, that'd be good too. Like, all allies within its circumference. I can get it and just see how good it is, and we can figure it out. Figure out if we want to keep it or not. It oh, it's a banquet. see that Renan Cuisine isn't to your liking. I asked my chefs to prepare only the finest delicacies available. Filled with poison, eh? Two wasted opportunities. With how smooth this guy is, we're about to like drink a cup of poison, and he's built up his immunity Why did you to set it. The here free when you took over. Ah, uh, but you are mistaken. You see, I may rule single-handedly, but on my own, even I cannot change the order of things. But what is within my power is the welfare of the people. The fostering of a mutual respect among the classes. This I can change. 
Sounds a lot like the Danins are still oppressed, if you ask me. Only in the sense they continue to serve as laborers, yes. However, I assure you they are fairly compensated for their efforts. This harmony we strive for is the current pinnacle of Ren and Danin coexistence. Harmony and coexistence between the Renans and the Danins. What about the crown contest? This doesn't exactly make you a shoe in That's what I was yet, thinking. The Danans here are even more productive than when they used to face daily lashings. In any case, the crown contest is of little importance to me, and even less to Elda Menencia. You see, I have no interest in becoming sovereign. Why not? Can another lord uproot him then? If he doesn't... become sovereign? Like, how did he uproot the previous lord? Hmm. Playing music. What? They're fighting against each other? <gasps> Did he have to kill him? Because because of how they rule. And was that like one of his friends that he was playing music with? Stop this. He didn't Please. want to. Over. No. Did he kill him? No. How could you? I swear. I swear. I'll never forgive you for this. This is horrible. Oh my gosh. It broke him. That's why. It is not by choice that one assumes the throne of a realm. But sovereign is a different matter entirely. I have no interest in playing their game. Are you saying you'll withdraw from the contest? I guess if you don't plan to ascend the throne, there's not much reason to harvest energy from Danins, is there? Let the ambitious fight it out amongst themselves. All I care for is maintaining peace throughout my realm. So what? Your personal desires are all that matter to you? Take a look in the mirror. I may not play their games, but you have outright betrayed your own. You've torn down two of my fellow lords. What precisely is your aim? That is true. Spare me your answer. I care not for your reasons. Suffice it to say, I will not impede you. That said, should you threaten the peace of my realm... <laughs> He's gonna become the sovereign respond. if we end up killing all the other lords. I suggest you can if we don't kill him leave men and Sia at your earliest convenience Kelzalik. sovereign by default Our guests depart. please see to their lodgings for the night unless Xion gets to him or tries to get to him again but Xion kind of got uh, wrecked I shall arrange for rooms for you all at a local inn it is a short ways down the road you may stay there for the night, after which I suggest you promptly make your departure. Damn. Well, look at how ritzy this place is. I like this place. It's pretty. How many pretty. rooms do you think it's got? Don't you think you're being a little too relaxed? I don't know how to get out of here. Uh, an us, infamous alias. An alias? Yeah, let's look at the skit. So you're the blazing sword of Calaglia now, huh? Come to think Oh, of it, that's his name. Annabelle calling you that too. Yeah. 
The Iron Mask, the, the Blazing Sword of Calaglia. Yeah, and that's the man not a good thing either. And the black armor. What do you mean? That's something you should be proud of, if anything, Alfin. They're scared of you, man. You're a real badass. It's not as simple as that, Law. The more well known he is, the more people might come after True. him. True. The more Renans are no, going to come after that's him. That's not what I'm worried about. It isn't? When people call me that, it feels like there's something hanging over me that shouldn't be there. It's hard to put into words, but it's something that doesn't feel like a part of me. Something I can't let be a part of me. Or else. Hmm. Well, I still think it's pretty amazing. But that's just me. I have no idea how we get out of this place. We're in this room right here. What's, what's across the hall? The office? Okay. They just let us freely explore this place. Isn't my mill... Hey, isn't my mill ready yet? Or what? I'm sorry, we're still fixing it. Great, I'm still waiting on that paperwork I asked for you too. I'm terribly sorry, I'll go check on what's happening with that right away. Oh, so the people in these in these outfits are Renans, and the people in this outfit are, are Danon. So it's pretty easy to be able to tell the Renans from the Danons. The end that we have reserved for you is straight down the road once you leave the pause. Do not make his excellency regret this generosity. I'm sure this is such a great idea, Sir Kalzilek. Do you not realize that our guests are still here? We'll have this conversation later. You're trying to talk to us in front of the dude? Gosh, this place is gorgeous. Keep on saying that, but it is. Do you really think we should trust accommodations from a Renan Lord? How do we know it's safe? Like we have any other choice. We can't go and set up camp outside of town at this hour. Honestly, I'd still take that over staying here. What if they try to kill us in our sleep? I doubt that's the case. His best chance to kill us would have been back at the palace. His true intentions aside, for now at least we're in his good. Yeah, they would have killed us already if you wanted to. Test his patience. Let's find that in and check in. We do have a skit here called "The Fruits of Dan and Labor," so let's go ahead and watch that. Interesting. All we ever got was a tattered blanket, a rock-hard bed, and well past its prime food. What are you talking about? What we got for our slave labor back in Calaglia. As you can tell, it wasn't much at all. Here, the Danans get the same basic amenities, but the quality is way better than anything we were given. That Hell, is true. Apparently, they even get time off to do what they want. If I'm being honest, I'm... I'm not sure how to take all this in. Like, they're still under subjugation. It's just, like, slightly better else? subjugation. It was the same in Cislodia, too. Our buildings and clothing were equipped to handle the cold, but that was the only difference. Working the floodlights was a form of punishment, so we didn't really get rewarded for anything that we did. Yeah, you could be assigned to fix food or make daily necessities too, but when all was said and done, most of that stuff went to the Renans. There wasn't much in the mm. way of compensation for any of that, so I'd say that Cislodia mm. and Calaglia were both pretty awful. Then Elder Menencia really is unusual. To say the least. Hell, I might even go so far as to call it crazy. But the fact remains, Danons aren't free here. Yep, exactly. Yeah. And the moment no that this lord loses slaves. his position, they're going right back what to what to they've right been now. under for this the last 300 years. It's giving me a headache. Uh, lord Dahalim. Another skit. This game has so many skits. So that was Lord Dahalim, huh? Dahalim. Sure is something. I'm going to always pronounce this guy's name wrong. We've met up until now. At first, he sounded like just some snobby royal, but he immediately shut down Xion's surprise attack. He's tougher than he looks. Definitely. After all, he's a lord for a reason. The food was pretty damn good, too. Why are you two complimenting him? You just said it yourself, Alfin. He's a Renan lord. Yeah, but he didn't act hostile towards us. You're reading him wrong. He's acting indifferent. He's attempting to keep some distance between himself and everyone else. It's obvious. Mm -hmm. What are we going to do then? 
The synth seems to be legit peaceful. Are we just gonna do as he says and leave things be? I'm not entirely sure. For now, I think it would be best for us to rest at the inn and think about our options. Yeah, I'm, I'm wondering if we're actually gonna try to take him out or not. All right, so the inn, I think I've been to the inn before. But we can go ahead and run back there. Oh, it's actually nighttime here, too. So even no longer daytime. Are still technically slaves here. They aren't being oppressed. If Calaglia had been like this, would we have been content? Oh, there it is. There been any reason to stand and fight? Hmm. Let's head toward... Okay, this is the end. Welcome, fair travelers. Lord Dohalim's retainer told us to expect you. It is an honor for you to stay with us. Please, make yourselves comfortable. This is better than I expected. Hmm? The room. It's nice. What's wrong with Law? Why, why is he stumbling oh, in? Is he just tired? Yeah. It is pretty nice. You okay, Law? You're a million miles away. Nah, it's weird. I felt strange ever since we arrived here. Can't seem to shake it. Maybe it's something about this place. You're just tired. I'm feeling pretty sluggish myself. You too? Seriously, huh. you two? A word to the wise, our work here is far from over. Get yourselves together. <sighs> I'm sorry, but I need to call it a day. Well, let's meet back here tomorrow morning and see where things go from there. Sound good? Sure, but keep an eye out for anything strange, okay? I wonder if... We still don't know how safe this place really is. Law and Alfin are going to be affected by something, but... Renwell and, uh... Shion aren't affected by it for some reason. Are you two feeling any better? Yeah, a good night's sleep seems to have done the trick. I wonder why we felt so out of it. You think it might have been because of all the food we ate? You don't think they slipped something into our food, do you? That must be it. Huh? If they were making an attempt on our lives, we'd know. Yeah, they would be know. dead. I doubt Though, that. On the other hand, they could be warning us off. But they didn't. But only it, Law didn't felt it. At the meal, Rinwell? Aren't you starving? Oh, I made myself something later. Oh, okay, you okay. Out. That was some mighty fancy grub they served yesterday. What? And so Rinwell didn't eat any of the food. Me too? Are you crazy? What's the big deal? She ate it too, remember? And we both tried the same stuff. Well, maybe they laced it with poison that's only harmful to Danins, hmm? That's enough, Rinwell. <sighs> Renwell and like La are always bickering and then Shion and Alfin are always bickering from? and then Law and uh Alfin just adore each other Black Kitty Where's this kitty going to lead us to? Lead us somewhere. I'm going to follow it. Hey, where do you think you're going? Oh, the black kitty. Okay. Oh my gosh, that kitty's so tiny and it's going so quick. It's so adorable. Stay close. We're gonna lose it. What's gotten into you, Law? This might be the lead we've been waiting for. Seriously? Yeah. Some people train animals. I wonder if this messengers. cat's gonna start talking. Don't attract attention, <laughs> and you think that someone might be using that cat? Kind of like the dog in uh, Tales of Hysteria. I could be wrong, but it's possible. I'm impressed. I would never have thought of that. I should know. We used to use them in Cislodia. She's so adorable. Okay, so we got to keep up with the cat. cat. Oh, we ha we also have a skit here. I'm gonna I'm gonna watch the skit first though. So that black cat. Do you think it works for someone? I'm sure it does. It wouldn't try to lead us around like that if somebody didn't train it to. I wouldn't know. I've never had one myself. If I did, hmm. it'd probably try to eat poor Hoodle. True. I doubt that I cat would not try to eat Hoodle. I doubt this is Dohalim's work. Yeah, he has no reason to do this. 
Although we can't rule out that it might be one of his lackeys either. You think one of his subordinates is up to something? That subordinates are trying to take us out. Unusual character for a Renan, let alone for a lord. It's hard for me to imagine that they all agree with what he's doing. Maybe one of them plucked up the courage to go rogue. Well, let's head further in. I'd like to figure out at least one of the mysteries of this place. But all the Renan guards here kind of seem like they kind of like him. So, I don't know. I don't feel like they're actually against him at all. Hmm. There's some items here. Pick up the mushies. Wait. So this is open now. There's no guard here now. Where do you think it's trying to lead us? Who knows? We should hurry. We don't want to lose it. Well, this is supposedly like the Renin Guard when we came back this, by here earlier said that this place was dangerous. Yeah. It just looks like an ordinary cute cat. We lost sight of the cat. After the chase it's led us on. Oh, There's this place is gorgeous bad. though. Go Underground forest. I get that underground forests aren't exactly something you see every day. It really could have done without any zoogles running around. You said it. I get the city up to We're underground right now. Walls, but now I won't be able to sleep easy knowing they're lurking underneath. You have nothing to fear. Zoogles work for the Renans. There might be strays out here, but the other zoogles won't let them get close. Using zoogles to keep watch over their own kind, huh? That would explain why we're not seeing any guards. Yeah, which makes it that much easier for someone to hide around here, too. Mm. Okay, an innocent brush. <sighs> well, he's fine, though. Sorry, Shion. My foot slipped. Are you all right? I should be asking you. <laughs> what am I saying? Of course you're okay. It's easy to forget sometimes. I wonder if the Anybody thorns actually cause damage or if it's just like getting, you know, surprised or like it hurts, but it doesn't oh, like, right. it can't the kill thorns. you or something. Yeah, I'm uh, no worse for wear over here. Again, sorry for brushing you like that without warning. Well, just be careful. <sighs> hey, Alfin. Hmm? Forget it. It's nothing. Hmm. I, we still, we still don't know why she has the thorns. Uh, well, okay. What's with those two? There's always something with those two. Yeah, we gotta make sure we collect everything here. This place is hey, gorgeous, though. Oh, it's whoa. Shiny. There's more mushies. They're just different kind of mushies. There's so many enemies that look very similar to one another, but they're just slightly different. Boom. No, I missed. No. Let's get him. Oh, I keep missing the like doing the the boost attack. Dude, raining slash is way too strong in this game. Raining slash is way too much, way too powerful. Good. We're counting on you, Rinwell. On me? It does like 600 damage per slash right now. Like, Eldie Men Menencia, in general, just looks gorgeous, like, all of it. Are these, like, berserkers? Oh, no, they're apes. Boom. Boom. Whoop. Get him. Oh, maybe we can down him. Wait, did I just... Oh, I just... I just got my, uh, over limit. Oh, 
Like, when I get into Overlimit, it's almost like I don't even want to use anything else except for just using the... the Scarlet Outburst as soon as possible. Maybe there's some kind of things on your emblem list that you can, uh, unlock in the future with your skill points. That will allow you to get, like, your Overlimit longer. so big is because of astral energy, right? It's possible, Whoop. but give them enough time and trees can get pretty big on their own without any extra help. And this is all underneath the city. Gosh, the fights in this game are getting hard, though. Hey, there's a... Well, that's not a campfire, but it's something that can uh, get me up, so that's good. Let's see if we can buy anything before we go any further. <laughs> yeah, I can craft her an air weapon now. Enhance arts for air. Cool. Sweet! So not everyone has their air weapon. Except for her. She just doesn't have an air weapon at all, which is kind of annoying. Oh, and I got more money. I'm impressed how well balanced. So let's go ahead and grab these. To heal ourselves up, get all our CP back. And then we can save before we actually go in there. <laughs> There's no way I'm not saving before this part. All right, to our debts we go. I see what's about to happen. It's crazy. I've never seen anything like these plants before. It's like they're an invasive species. Is that thing about to come to life? Dude, don't turn around. Don't turn around. Dude. Whoa. It's like floating. Oh, it has a bunch of spores. Oh, gosh. It's level 23? I'm only level 17. Oh gosh, I'm only like level 17 and 18. Oh no, I, I need I, I, I need to save uh, Renwell's uh, boost for the future. Hmm. Yeah, let's, let's, try, let's try to stay up high. Gosh, what what am I supposed to do here? Is there a way to get get it to come down? Mm -mm, severing wind. Oh, maybe, maybe, maybe I can down it? Oh, I missed it. I missed whatever I was trying to do here. Oh, gosh. Maybe we got to get away from him? Oh, gosh. Nope, I see it. Yeah, there's stuff in the ground that pops up that so you can kind of see what's happening. Yeah, you, I can't even shoot this thing up. Oh, almost got this one down. Got it. Boom! Got that one down. Gosh, I really like Severing Wind. It's like, I just need to use Severing Wind over and over and over again, it feels like. Oh gosh, there's enemies. Um, I think I, I can change target, right? Yeah, this boss is level, it's level, like, 23, but it's not too hard, actually. I was expecting it to be a little bit more difficult than this. Oh gosh, I gotta move, gotta move, gotta move. I'm trying to use the abilities to move myself. Okay, take him out. Oh, Shion's about to die. Come on, Shion. Oh no, Rion's dead. Or, yeah, Rion, Rinwell's dead. Come on. Please resurrect her. Please resurrect her. Oh gosh. Trying to get out of there. Oh my gosh. Shion, you better not die on me. You better just heal yourself, Shion. Good job. It's a good thing I have like the, the, the KO prevention on her. If I didn't have KO Prevention, it would be a little bit different than the fight that we're having right now. Got that one. Okay. So I think I, I think I got them all. Take this. 
Wait, how did I just teleport like that? I thought I somehow teleported way over here. Okay, now maybe we can attack the body now. Can we? Can we? Can we? Oh, I can. Bam! Spam it! Yes! Hmm! I'm gonna burn myself to take this guy out right now. Huh! Get in here! Let's go to big damage time! Oh, don't, don't die, don't die! I don't wanna die, I don't wanna die, I don't wanna die though! No, I just killed myself! What was I doing? Oh my god, I killed myself. This boss is, yeah, this boss is real easy, but I can't believe I just did that. I just gotta spam Severing Wind. There we go, we got him. <laughs> just took a while to get it down, but, but we totally got this boss. Easy peasy. Do we get more max CP or something from beating this boss? Everyone okay? Oh, there's a campfire behind us. I'm starting to get that Where's that cat at? Again, guys. We'll just pray you're wrong. Hey, there's that cat. <gasps> there it is. Looks like it's not done leading us yet. Can we sit at the campfire, please? I don't have that many cure points left. Did Law send something? I'm oh yeah, we can. Cool. One day I think you'll surpass him. I mean, I doubt there's anything here we can even buy. We don't need to buy anything right now. We can just stay at the campfire. And we can and we can eat some food. I haven't eaten food in a bit. Maybe there's some skits here too. Should we really be lighting a Nah, there's no skits, but the they're talking. You scared of starting a fire? As long as we put it out thoroughly afterwards. I feel like them talking in this section is really, kind of a, a skit a in it, of itself. It'll keep the Zoogles away. Have you both forgotten what we've come out here to do? I'll yeah, chase after a kitty you. is what we came out here Let's to do. Wind every now and again. <sighs> if you say so. So funny how we're like literally this entire mission just us chasing after a black cat. Okay, let's definitely cook though. Let's make something that will actually influence us in battle. So maybe elemental defense. That turned out good, if I do say so myself. I mean, let's talk to Rinwell because we actually well, actually have something we can talk to her about. Hoodle, come here, sweetie. Woo! Good boy. What are you doing? Uh, it's flying practice. Flying practice. Like my side, but if I don't make him spread those wings every now and then, they'll start to weaken. It's important he practices. Also, I'm pretty sure he put on some extra weight. Oh. Hmm. Probably because everyone keeps sneaking him snacks when you're not looking. I knew it. I thought there was something fishy going on. Oh, it's really not good for birds to be overweight, you know. Oh, really? Ah, uh, I'm sorry, Rinwell. You were feeding him too? You haven't been giving him anything he can't eat, have you? I'm pretty sure everything I've given him has been okay. Just to be sure though, why don't you tell me what he can't eat? Huh? Oh my gosh. Oh, uh, yeah. Alvin. Alvin's the matter? type of person that feeds chocolate to your no, dog. No, not at all. It's just, for a really long time, Poodle was the only friend I had. So, on the one hand, it makes me really happy to see everyone be so accepting. But, on the other, it's a bit of an adjustment sharing him, you know? Every one of us can see that he's like family to you. I can promise no one's trying to ignore your feelings or anything. Yeah, I'm sure you're right. I'll talk to the others about it later. You're now closer Hello. to one well. Let me know if you sense anything. Are there going to be owls in this place? Hmm. Law, growing boys. Because I made more food, I guess. Uh, I don't really have enough SP for anything. 
Another day, another gold. This had better not all be for nothing. Somehow I doubt it'll be a wasted trip. Really? Now we're about to get Whatever we're about to go right into a trap. Let's follow. We're we're gonna go in here and never come out. It's gonna be the last healer here of Iron Mask. <laughs> Sara, is she leading us? You know, for a guard, you're not too good at tailing people. That's what Law was sensing. Not to brag, but this kind of thing is my specialty. So it really is you. When Law told us, I almost didn't believe it. I'm just surprised you could do two things at once, Law. What's that supposed to mean? I mean, he was a snake eye. Wait. Are we fighting Kasara? Oh my god, we are. Like I don't want to fight my waifu. The one time I, wanted to resolve things I want her to fight with me. I want to fight as her. I don't want to fight her. Oh gosh, my waifu's about to kill me. Whoa, she's, she's actually tanky. I, I, I'm probably going to need Law to break her defenses. She has over 100,000 health. Okay, come on, Law. Help me. There we go. I actually got her now. God, Raining Slash is so strong. I don't get it. Oh! Oh no, she used her over limit. Oh gosh, she just one shot. She just one shot Law. Okay, maybe I can hit her with this, and then it, like, gets rid of her defense or something? Nope, it doesn't. Okay, maybe I can down her with this. Nope, it did not work. I can't down her. I need- I need law in order to down her. It's like, I literally can't do anything without law breaking her first. Dang it. G get her, law. Okay, come on. It's, and Raining Slash is still better than everything else I can do. Gosh, I love how tanky she is. Like, I want to play with her with how tanky she is right now. I always play tanks in games like this. Like, in any MMO, I play a tank in, um... In any, like, games I, I play tanks, like, it doesn't matter. I totally want to play with her. In the non lewd way. I mean, and in the lewd way. But you, you know what I mean. I can't be near her right now! Oh my gosh. Shion's gone. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta resurrect Shion. Like, I can't, I can't do fights without Shion. Shion's my most important person. I don't know how she ended up using her near death. Already. Come on, please say this fight's over at half health. Come on! Oh! We, we got her to half health. I don't know if this is going to do anything, but we're going for it. Oh, so that fight was over in half health. I was right. They used so what many resources to fight her. You she was just so tanky. Us. You send us away and then come to finish us off? I don't buy it. I wonder. We came here following a black cat. What reason could you have for tagging along? Certainly not as a spy. You think she might have business with whoever... Was that her black here? cat? Or was she just following us? And even if she did, I highly doubt she was trying to keep us from harm. Am I wrong? Just who was it that led us out here? Answer me. Are you serious? <laughs> Hold your horses. Who's that?